Hey Maximizers and welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, welcome. My name is Crystal. I'm a coupon coach and educator with my company, KristaMaximizer.com. And due to us being quarantined and shut in, I'm going to have some different types of videos on my channel just so that I have content to produce and then also so I'm not bored because I will not be shopping as much as I usually do. So today we are going to do a organize my kitchen. I am going to show you guys the mess that I have. I'm talk you through my plans of organization because if you don't know, I just moved. I upgraded my apartment within the same apartment complex. We went from a one bedroom to a two bedroom, two bathroom, which is freaking amazing. I love it. So if you haven't watched my apartment tour, packing and moving, I will link that video up here because it should be up. And now I'm going to show you guys as I organize my kitchen. It's actually it's Tuesday, March 17th. Happy St. Patrick's Day. And things are developing with us staying in so that we're not spreading. You know what? Not going to say the word because those videos are getting demonetized. So with that being said, I want to be able to make my coins. But I want to go ahead and show you guys the mess that I have to deal with and then what my plans are. All right, so this is the state of the union of my kitchen. And if I back up here, you guys can see. So this is just everything that needs to get organized because we just brought stuff in. You can see the pantry's open. So over there, I have one small pantry. I have all the cabinets. And then in here is a second pantry um, or the main basic pantry. So I bought a little shelf to put in here and then I have these shelving units. So now my brain is just trying to figure out where I'm going to put everything. Um, also, let me draw to your attention. I went to Walmart and I can, I'll can i share that Walmart haul. I'll link it in the description box as well. I got an over the door organizer to put on that pantry door. And then I got a metal storage rack that I can put inside of there. Because I wanted to have storage to put in that uh, pantry because it's just a lot of large space. There's Kinsley jumping up and down. So I have filled up some of the cabinets. I have an idea of what I wanna do. I want this to be like cups and such. So I have, I just put stuff there just to get it off the counter. We do have a wine rack. I have one bottle. I do plan to get more because Bay is supposed to be here. I'm not sure if he's here or not when you guys see this video. Um, and then I put some of my plastic bowls and stuff in here and I have yet to put anything up there, but I did put stuff in here, but I'm gonna reorganize it again. I was just getting stuff out of bags, like unpacking so we can continue to move. So I'm gonna put, like things in these main cabinets that we use a lot. And then I'm going to put like more like storagey kind of things over there and try to just reorganize my cabinets. So if you're interested in seeing how I organize all this mess, then just keep on watching. All right, Maximizers, hope you guys can still see me. First things first, I'm going to organize some things. And I do look a hot mess, so don't judge me. We've been in the house all day. So I've already decided that my trash can is gonna go in here. That is for sure, because I want it out of the way. Um, I'm also going to turn on the show, and I'm going to time-lapse this. Um, I have paper towels here. I need one roll out. I have no idea what my paper towel holder is, so I need to get that. So I'm going to go put these where I'm going to put them, and I used to have them in that closet. But I think because I have space, I'm going to leave one pack in here, or I may be able to put my paper towels in here and then leave the toilet paper over there um this is trash all right so now at this point i'm gonna i'm going to just time lapse and speed this up and then also pop in when i need to talk can we stop i also think that i'm going to go ahead and put these things together so that way I can start putting stuff there to really alleviate space. So I'm going to put this over the door rack together and watch a show. So I'm gonna just turn this off while I gather these pieces and then I'll come back and show you guys it. Okay, maximizers, it took a minute, but I got the over the door shelf so I can actually start to put some things in here. It's sturdy, it's secure. So I'm super excited for this. I'm gonna go ahead and put together the other shelf and stick that in here. And then I'll have a clear head and a clear space to figure out what I'm going to put where. I'm excited. All right, maximizers, the shelf is done. I'm actually watching this show containment on netflix i probably should not be watching this as 
dealing with an outbreak ourselves, but I'm watching it. It's super interesting. Um, so we're gonna put this in here. All right, let me move this. Let's hold on. I have so many bags. I started to recycle a bunch of them because I'm like, I had too many plastic bags, and I'm gonna start using recyclable bags at the store. Okay. You know, I might need another one of these, y'all. Depending on what else I can put in here. Mm, do I want that like that? Or I can put it like this. I do have a tote bin that I'm gonna put in here, like my medicine tote bin, um, because I have my cat litter box in the other box. I mean, in the other closet. So I'm gonna put the medicine and all that stuff in here. So I have that. I'm gonna stack my paper towels here. This is our Disney and pool toys. I'm gonna put that stuff right here in the corner. And then I'm gonna put cat food here. So now I'm just going to figure out how to organize. I'm gonna start in the kitchen. And then I'm gonna come over here and I'm gonna show you guys like clips along the way because if I, I've realized, bless you, if I speed this up, it'll be like two hours worth of footage. So I'm just gonna go little by little and bring you guys along for each section. All right, Maximize, your girl is tired. So what did I do in here? Not much. I just put all of the cat food down there and then I'm gonna put my Febreze and stuff on this top shelf. I have no idea what I'm gonna put in the middle shelf yet. So I have dry cat food, wet cat food, and then all the cat sprays and stuff. I organized that. And I didn't put anything on here yet because I'm not there yet. I just had so much stuff on these counters, y'all. So we put all of the glasses which I think this is all of my glasses and I have more space because I've been I got rid of a lot of stuff before this whole entire thing was filled and then I have my teamy cups and then any specialty cups like we have SeaWorld Kinsley got this from the, Cray the Crayola factory so she likes to drink out of those so I leave those there um I put my knives right here I still have to take the rest of the knives out of there my tequila, I don't know where I'm putting it yet. I haven't even cracked it open. I still have these bags to go through. I did fill up plastic bowls, glass bowls, all the lids for the bowls. This is where my um, I have dishes to wash, but like my strainer, big bowls. And then these are meal prepped. I love these because um, they sell these at Walmart. So whenever I'm meal prepping, when I used to go to work or whenever I do my smoothie cleanse and you need a divided container with the lid and it comes with a fork and knife and I just reuse it even though it's plastic. And then I put my extra box of bowls. I got those on Black Friday. I put those up there. So like once these get old and crummy, like I threw some away. I use some in the bathroom to like clean off the bathtub and everything. Once they get old and crummy, I just grab whatever I need from there and like rotate those in. Um, my blenders are here my can opener this google home mini that i still haven't opened yet um the i put dishes away so before i show you the dishes this is just what's under the sink i need to add like more hand soap i only have four i think i have two other hand soaps somewhere but i have like four to six hand soaps besides what's like already in the bathroom dish soap i definitely need more dish soap but i have a giant refillable thing back there as well i have my um dishwasher pods and then trash bags here thank goodness i did all those walgreens deals of trash bags and then like here's more paper plates and what else is in here all kinds of stuff in here y'all i need to go through and then my dishes so i have pots and pans and then i have my crock pot and my blender well, mixer, not a blender, mixer. And then I have this flat top stove, which I love to cook pancakes and sausage on. That thing's amazing. And then all of my cookie sheets, baking pans, my um, cutting boards back there. And then whenever I want to make sweet tea or Kool-Aid and big masses, it's back there. The, the containers for those. Um, I have just utensils in here. And then this is like my junk drawer. I so like basically i still have a bunch of junk stuff to put in here but like my scissors are in here the lighter this is from that thing i just put together and i'll just put it all like in one of these things and this is just like a junk drawer so i still have all of this stuff to put away and organize and there's stuff up there so i'm gonna get back at it tomorrow because guess what y'all we got nothing but time so 
I'll see y'all tomorrow when I work on kitchen day two. So we're gonna do kitchen and then I also need to do the bathroom, but I'm gonna show you guys just the kitchen and maybe my desk area. Those are the two I'll commit to video. So you're gonna see a kitchen video and then you'll see me organizing my desk. So I will see you guys tomorrow. Oh wait, no, I lied. I just, <laughs> I'm not gonna see you tomorrow. I haven't showed you the pantry. So I decided to put cereal, hot cereal and cold cereal right here. I'm gonna put like the backup sugar, which I only have one because Kinsley ruined a whole bag of sugar, which is another story for another day. I thought I had two, three bags and no, so I need more sugar. But sugar's gonna go up there and then like back stock. I'm also gonna put like all these back stock of, of storage bags. I'm only gonna keep like the open ones here and then I have some somewhere else too. But I'm gonna put anything that's not open up there out of my way and then I have this flour and sugar. I'll leave those down. Um, and then I have canned goods down here, which I um, may just keep those down there. And then more snacks and stuff will go here. And then I still have to figure out what I'm putting inside the pantry pantry in the closet. So we'll see. I just, I have more space than I did before. So I'm just excited to like spread things out and not have to have stuff like just everywhere. So I'm excited. So now at this point, I will see y'all tomorrow. Because as you can see, it is 11.35 p.m. So I will see y'all tomorrow for day two. And we should be able to finish this. I just shoved that on there because I was like, I found it in a bag. And I got through, a, I got, I did a lot, y'all. I feel accomplished. Like there's space. We can, we can walk around now because for a while it was a hot mess. All right. So I will see y'all tomorrow. One other thing I want to tell you guys is I do have to wash my dishes. This is the ice tray that comes with the apartment. So I wanted to sanitize that before we make ice. But one thing I wanted to tell you guys, um, since I stopped buying bottled water, somebody asked me, I have a Brita pitcher. And basically what I'm going to do is, so when Kinsley's like, mommy, I want water, I am going to wash out all of these because we haven't used these in a while. Sanitize these and I'm going to pour water in them by the day. These two are for mommy. These two, and Kinsley has two other ones, four for Kinsley, two for mommy that we'll drink out of and just have water in. And so that way when Kinsley's like thirsty, she can just go in and grab it, how she used to just grab a bottle of water. So this will just make life so much easier. So that's a tip. If you want to stop the whole bottled water thing, use reusable water bottles. We got these from a multitude of different spaces. My old job, we were at some event, um, the school, and Walgreens. They were These were all like in bags that we got, you know, totally free. So basically keep these and then even these ones up here. I drink water out of my teamy cups all the time. I drink, Kinsley drinks water out of those things because she likes the straws. So that is one quick tip, and that's why these are here along with the rest of the dishes that I need to wash, which will get washed tomorrow. So again, I will see you guys tomorrow. All right, guys, I'm done in here. So I put my toilet paper and my paper towels in here, floor cleaning supplies, and then over here we have the Veggie Pro. I have these Lysol wipes that I need to put. I have a couple more packages of them. I've been using them, so I have a couple more packages. They're gonna go like kind of in this corner liquor this is my hurricane kit and then this is our disney stuff i need to go through it i just don't feel like it so it's gonna stay in this bag until i feel like it i have my like this is my medicine that used to be in my bathroom but i put it out here so i'm gonna put some other stuff in here too but this is all kinds of medicine stuff vitamins and my eye gl my old glasses and eyeglass <sighs> what's it called y'all contact from a context the context holders also all kinds of medicine this is like our medicine cabinet and then i have all the cleaning stuff the cooler the trash these are my reusable shopping bags i'll take with me shopping plastic bags and then cleaning so i'm done in here i filled up this whole thing i had this thing on wrong but i fixed it because the thing was falling off so one section is done along with the kitchen and again when i find the rest of my last old wipes i'll put them in there it's like a month later now and i'm posting this video literally today but i just wanted to give you a quick quick update and end the video so basically i redid this a little bit and i took out like the disney stuff and i put that in kinsley's closet so this is like our backup stock for snacks so we have kinsley's muffins Chex mix doritos i bought some pretzels peeps from um easter extra fruit snacks extra cereal and then i have extra margarita mix and i put the napkins here and then all that stuff is there so i wanted to give you guys that final update of our pantry everything else over here is still the same i have this hanging up the vacuum cleaner usually goes there and we even have a tool whoops you can't see we even have a toolkit that they had to buy to fix kinsley's bike but now i have a full toolkit um 
I'm about to cook dinner, but I got this from Macy's, just like a nice, really neat and simple dish rack. And then the other thing I wanted to show you is just how I updated the pantry. So I put all my back stock of storage bags and stuff up there. Cereal and bread is still here. Snacks, snacks, snacks. And then some cans. I put the sugar and the flour down here. These are bags and like other snacks that we're eating. And then over here, this is like back stock. So this is like the stock of stuff. And then when we're ready to use it, we transfer it over to the other pantry. And in, in here, I have bottles of juice and soda in the lower cabinet. And then over here, your girl has soda that I got from Walgreens. And then these is just a coaster and a napkin holder that I have. So that's the other stuff that you didn't see. You pretty much seen everything else and how I have everything else organized. Not sure if I gave you a clear view of like all the pots and pans. It's a hot mess under here because I just... I've been cooking a lot and I don't have time to keep it organized because I've just been cooking, grabbing pots that I need. So I have those appliances there. And then my appliances that I use every day. So this is like a griddle, needs to be cleaned, of course. But then I bought a toaster and then I have my blender. I have my teeny mix it back here and I have my can opener. So I have that stuff on the counter. I've been making pancakes every couple days, toast and margaritas every day too. I hope you all have enjoyed our pantry organization slash tour of our kitchen. If you have any questions, please comment those down below. Our, is your pantry really organized? Is your kitchen really organized? Please, please, please go and watch a couple of our videos and let the ads play through. We would really, really appreciate it. And as always, please like, share, and subscribe. Thank you all so much for watching, and I will see you in the next video.